Let's talk drop shipping. First of all, I hear that a lot of people are telling me that drop shipping is dead or drop shipping is saturated. Well, let me tell you, it's not. Problem is that a lot of people are just expecting fast results and that's never gonna happen. What this needs is deep research. It needs hard work from your side and it needs consistency. And also, if you think the drop shipping is dead, well, just ask all of these people on TikTok what they think about it. Yeah, I know there's a lot of people out there and that is the biggest problem. There's a lot of people out there just telling you that you can get your first sale in a week or you can get like $2,000 like in one month, in your first month. And that is actually what keeps you down. I know there's a lot of these YouTubers talking about drop shipping like it's a piece of cake. But let me tell you right away. No, it's not. All right. Drop shipping can and will work in 2023. But just like any business venture in the online world, it requires a lot of hard work and a lot of patience from your side. And this is where we come to AI tools. In the last year or so, there's like thousands of these AI tools that are just popping out. And some of these I use for my dropshipping business. So I wanted to share these with you. They can help you. Don't think that they will just take away your jobs. They can just speed up the process in your work, which you got to do. Let's start with the first one. Unless you are living under a rock for a last year or so, the first one is, of course, going to be this chat GPT. But no, we're not going to use chat GPT. We're going to use perplexity.ai. Remember this name. It's way better than chat GPT just because it is up to date. All right. It can go online and it can do the research for you in real time. Have a look at this comparison. So I'm going to ask chat GPT this. So what are the best niches currently out there? But as you can see, as of my last knowledge update in January 2022, well, even chat GPT admits that it is limited up to January 2022. And it gives you some kind of information. But let me ask the same question to perplexity. You can see that it will give you the sources. So these are the references where it went online to do the research for you. And you will even get the pictures, whatever you are searching for. And of course, you will get a response. This is good for research. This is good for your product descriptions. This is good for niche selection. This is also good for scouting out your competitors. And it's always going to be up to date, just like, for example, Google Bard. But this one is better for me. It has a nicer interface. And this one, just forget about it. Number two is Flare. Dot AI. And this is really important for everyone out there who is considering some drop shipping. When drop shipping, it is very, very important to have a landing page that is visually appealing to the visitors and that stands out from the competition, right? After all, that's where you are sending all of that traffic to. It needs to look good and it needs to be welcoming to your customers. I know that many people out there find the product build a complete Shopify store around it in a matter of hours, and they just forget to actually invest time into the visual look of the store and the product images. You have to know that you're not the only one selling a certain product. You gotta know that. So you should strive to add some uniqueness to your offer to stand out from the rest. It can be anything from the product title, product description, pricing structure, up sales, and most importantly, the product images. When it comes to that, I use Flare.ai and it enables you to put a product image from Google, for example, and Flare will remove like any background. And also it will place the product in a nice and very realistic environment that you can then export and put it in your product page. Now, of course, not all the images that it generates will be good, but most of them are. And this will really enhance the visual appeal of your product page, as you can see in this picture. And you can change with all of these templates. For example, you can just do it, click on the generate. It will generate the prompt for you as well. As you can see, like the whole prompt has been done automatically just by using these templates that you can see on the left hand side here. There's really a ton of templates and the program is free to use like until a certain number of generations and exports, of course. And you can see in a nutshell, it can really look beautiful. However, if you are someone who is more experienced into that and you don't want to use this or you just want to edit these that Flare 
gives you. You can add a bit more touch with Photoshop.ai. That's what I work on, but you gotta keep in mind that this is in the beta phase, so Photoshop AI is in the beta phase still, but it can do a lot of really, really great things. Basically, you're just going to go and enter what do you want to get in the picture. As you can see, this lighthouse is a really good thing. You just draw like the rectangle. You write on the picture what you want to be generated, and it gives you exactly that. It's a beautiful thing. The third one is really good for scouting out your competitors. It's called browse.ai, and it makes you really spy on people to monitor your competitors on autopilot without having to do any of the manual work. I personally use this one to see if the e-commerce store owners are uploading new parts to their stores or if they're running any new ads. You know, basically it allows you to go to the website and take a screenshot or select like a specific element on the web page that you want to like monitor. And whenever a change or an update of what you've selected happens, you will get notified. Really good for extraction. And just think about it. If you find out that your competitors are just doing the exact same product or finding a different product and running new ads and you see that they've just gotten a lot of sales, well, you've just got yourself a product. They did all the work, you just monitored their success and then you can do the exact same thing. Everyone is copying from one another and you can do it as well. Now, if you're just starting out, this is Luca and this is a beautiful thing in order for you to design a logo for yourself. All you gotta do is to enter the company name. I'll just try with this one, get started. Now you will just have to select the industry. So for example, let it be restaurant, like don't want it. Let's just do it like that. Click on continue, pick some logos that you like. So this is gonna be like the template on which this AI tool will build on. So let's say that for example, I like this one, click on continue, select the colors that are matching your style, matching your product, whatever you want, continue, and then just add a slogan, which you don't even have to. Click on continue, food, restaurant, click some symbol types, and then they will generate a lot of options for you. They're just gonna like pop up like this one by one, and then you can just choose whichever one of these you want, download it, and use it forever. It's a really good thing. The last one is on Canva, actually. You gotta pay for it, and it's in the Magic Studio here. They've got this magic design. It's still in the beta phase, but it's really, really a time saver for you, especially if you're just running your social media profile yourself. Whatever you want to do, it will generate the templates. So you know that Canva has a lot of templates, but this will generate the templates for you. For example, you want this like poster. This can be a really great time saver, as I've told you, if you're running a business and you want your business account theme page or whatever filled with content. Now, I'm going to be completely honest with you. Magic Studio is like an ocean of tools. So I'll just leave it up for you to check it out and to explore. And lastly, I wanted to give you this website. You can just Google for future tools. This website has a lot of AI tools. They've just gathered all of them in one place and you can just go and search through these industries, choose the keywords and you will see what has come up in the online world in the selected thing. There's really like tons of them. You can find something for yourself, whatever you are looking for. So that's it. Happy drop shipping or whatever you are doing with these tools and I'll catch you next time.